Hello folks, Major Gosnell here, and today is going to be episode 6 of the Distant Worlds Universe, The Major Empire. So, just going to log in here. Do, do, do. Where is that? Major 5, that was it. And open. Now, after I finished the video the last time, I noticed something that I hadn't actually spotted. Somebody has declared war on me. The Naxian Federation has actually declared war on me. <laughs> I'm not really sure quite why, or how I missed it entirely. So we're just going to take a look at them when we load in here. And I think that's it. Do, do, do. Hopefully. Okay, there we go. So, let's take a look at our diplomacy screen. And where are these guys now? The Naxalidian Confederacy, not Federation. So these guys decided to open war with us. And I hadn't even realized what exactly was going on here. So these are the Naxian Confederacy. They have military strength of 917. We have 478. So they have a massive strategic advantage here. And they also have 985 strategic value. We're better on strategic value. Okay, GDP is 47k. We've 81k. So we're, we're in a lot... Oh, no, that's Tax revenue, 61k. So we're slightly ahead of them there. Population-wise, mm, a little bit more than them. Tree colonies to our one. Okay, these guys could be a bit of a problem for us. So we're just going to zoom out and see where exactly they are located on the map. And I think it's up here. Yep, Naxian Confederacy. So as you can see, they've got tree colonies, and they are extended into... No, that's not theirs. So, yeah, it they're pretty good positioning here. That's Mole Junction Alliance. Who are those guys? And what is their relationship to the Naxian? Cautious, so they're not at war with them. Let's see who else is furious with them. Us and they're angry. Oh. So it doesn't go both ways. Right. So there's a few other people angry and annoyed at them as well. So hopefully we can fend them off for the time being. They are rather far away from us. A couple of sectors. So we might be safe and secure here. Like we're all the way down. No, where the hell are we? I've lost my planet. Ah. Oh, here we go. So... We're down here, they're up there. Uh, they could strike us, they really could strike us. So we need to take a look at our military strength now as well. Uh, ships and bases, military ships. Okay, so we're building a lot of military ships as well. So that'll help matters significantly. However, we do need to build a lot more to get our military up and running properly. But we have to wait for our large spaceport. <laughs> we are in a bit of a catch-22 right now. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get all of our military ships in one place. So... And we need to rename our military ships as well. So that's going to be the first thing that we take care of. Priorities, naming ships over war preparations. So Javelin MK4020, that is going to be the MDF. Da, da, da. Juggernaut. Okay, MG, MDF Juggernaut. There we go. Da, 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 MDF Louise. Okay. It's going to be the MDF Lestat. Hope somebody gets the reference. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, just realized I did upper casings on Louise there. Okay, now this one is going to be MDF Joker. Do, do, do. MDF Gallipoli. Not really sure if that's how you spell it or not, but screw it.
MDF Wolfcrest. Okay, and the MDF Horatio. Okay, so that's our fleet getting named up there now. Okay, so next things now is a large spaceport. We're going to have to wait for that to be built. That's going to take time. Oh, God. So let's get all of our ships together here. Just so they're not scattered if we're attacked. Uh, should we put them in a the fleet? New fleet? Yes. First fleet. Radio. So we have to select next fleet. No, I don't think there is. Um, so we have to select fleet. No, that didn't work either. Ah, what the hell am I doing? Okay, so. Ah, there we go. So all my military ships are going to go here. I'm going to put them around patrol of my planet. Actually, we're going to automate the fleet. That should help matters significantly. Right. Now, let's see what we're doing here now. We need to get that bloody planet up and running. Or not planet, uh, spaceport. That's being built at a fairly reasonable pace. Empire has begun tree or change. Friendliness, increased population growth. Oh, might be able to get them to join us here. What's the name? Salarkin. Where the hell are those guys? I don't think we've met them yet, actually. Huh. Okay, well, let's speak with the pirates, see if they've got any more um, information for us. Oh! Did the request? Yes, we will pay that. By information, no. Okay, that's another empire. There we go. And who were those guys? Ah, here we are. So, speak with these guys. Uh, let me say territory map, territory map. Excellent. Just want to get them up with us here a bit. <coughs> Free trade agreement. Okay, they're angry with us for some reason. Dun, dun, dun. How do you set up a trade agreement? Ooh, they want a lot of money to declare one of those guys. And who's happy with us? Our empire produces a large amount of trade for them. Ooh, so we got a good trade with them. It's a bit of a disadvantage for me, but would you accept this trade? Capital. Okay. So let's see whereabouts we are now. Uh, colony ships. Do we have one built yet? Oh yes, there was a gentleman on YouTube, um, I can't remember his name just at the moment, my apologies, but a shout out to him, I will name you in the next video, who's given me a couple of tips regarding explorers and how to get better access to the galaxy's uh, unique features, so I'm going to actually get around to doing that as well, complete research in high density alloys. So the new component, enhanced armor, ooh, I'm going to have to retrofit again at some point. OK, 
Okay, and colony ships. We've discovered a stone monastery, ancient ruins from a lost civilization. Need to do investigate. Stone Monastery, we've made a curious discovery. A data core found in the ruins contains a message that reveals historical details about the galaxy's distant past. The message appears to be confidential intelligent report describing the arrival of a new empire in the galaxy. The Shaktor Axis arrived in our galaxy approximately ten years ago. They have quickly established a reputation for cruelty and aggression. We should proceed with extreme caution in any dealings with them. They are totally untrustworthy. The Shaktori clearly intend to dominate all around them. They demonstrate utter contempt for their neighbors. Their treatment of the Atakian kingdom is a prime example for their brutality. We strongly suspect the Shaktori are secretly working to overthrow all of the empires in the region. What their subsequent objective is remains unclear at this stage. So they sound like a nice bunch. What can go wrong, eh? Hey. Okay. We do need to update our explorers. Oh. We like this war to begin with, but now it's no fun anymore. Yes, the war that neither side has done anything in at all. <laughs> yeah, we agree. This war ends now. That was fucking weird. Okay. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> uh, the, the colony ship. Uh... Hey, excellent! It's here. So we're going to set up another colony in... Oh, shit. I uh, just realized research in high-tech is not doing anything. Uh, advanced research exploration... Uh... Actually, we need to get damage control done as well. Where is damage control? Do, 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 do. Where is damage control? Okay, we're gonna get the um, colonized things up as well. I'm trying to find damage control here. I can't seem to see it at all. Might be under a different heading. Something I completely forgot about. So, advanced research exploration, anyway, that's important. And da, 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 da. Ah, there we go. Number four. Yeah, what are we researching before that, though? That's one. Where the hell are the other ones? That's tree, coordinated maneuvering, so we can lower that one down. What is number two? Okay, well, hopefully that'll help matters. So, oh, here we go. Enhanced hyperdrives. Uh, well, we kind of need that one, so we probably should keep that. Okay, is there any colonizable planets? Expansion planner. Hey, do do. Okay. Let's see if there's any actual planets we can expand to here. Potential colonies. Do, do, do. Ventron Yimbo. Okay, let's go to that one. Ooh, that's miles and miles away. Are we able to colonize anything in our home sector, actually? Yeah, we need to research Continental first, I think. Damn, damn it. We're gonna get a couple of colonies up and running here. How's my base coming along? Ooh! Nope, that's not the base. Why is it saying 335 components unbuilt?
think I might have a bit of a bug here. It's not showing the actual development. Do our engineers have completed research in maximize trust? Excellent. Actually, we are going to go into designer here. And do where is our explorers? Ah, here we go. And manually upgrade design. Right. So, the gentleman on YouTube recommended... Oh, and by the way, it was a comment on YouTube, not an actual video, that I upgrade my fuel. Yeah, there should be enough fuel there. Okay, and... Oh, drop that one there. Okay. So, let's see what we have here now. Two fission reactors. I want to get one more fission reactor in there. I don't know. We should be okay with two, I'd imagine. Do, do, do. Okay. We're also going to add... Oh, where is that? Proton thrusters. Accelerous engine. Okay, so we're going to lose the proton thrusters. We are going to put the Accelerous engines on board. Life and Hab. Okay. Give it some enhanced armor as well, just so it's not quite as weak. Okay, combat targeting system, fuck it. And we'll give it some weaponry as well. Okay. Oh yes, the trust vectors would be a good idea as well. Ooh, that's severely curtailed my speed there. Ooh. Okay. Should be pretty good there. And we're going to change the design of these as well. I don't want really to like the design of our explorers. Let's go down to these. See which one is a good design. That's a pretty good one. Okay. And save. Right. And build some Ooh, yeah. Goddamn clicking. Okay. Need to upgrade our. Scientists made a critical breakthrough while researching energy torpedo weapons. So oh, excellent. Oh, they're now building the spaceport. It was a colony ship we were building there. So we need to keep that colony ship available for a second. The frack is this guy? Okay. And I just want to see if we've actually got a mining station up and running yet on that planet. We don't. Hmm. What is our status on Krypton, however? Oh, we got good strategic reserve. We're okay. I think we do need to build a few more construction ships, though. So. 
And that's coming along very nicely as well. Okay, so we're kind of at an impact. Oh, research. What do we want to research next? Advanced phasers. Hmm. Could be useful. Research them. And then we're going to expand our fighter base as well, a little bit, I think. We work on our missiles after that. Good work. Okay. Curious now what all the fighter bays I put on the spaceport see how it actually goes. It's going to retrofit. Oh, let us discuss something. Request protection? Yeah, yeah, we request it. Where is my fleet at the moment? Why is our fleet just camped around this mining station here? I know it's important and all, but Jesus. If planet gets hit, we're really screwed. Oh, do we have refueling rights with the United Libya Empire? Research advanced research exploration, okay. Oh, ships are already docking there. Excellent. My economy is probably going to go through the roof right now. It's already b producing stuff as well. Excellent. Yep. What do we have here? We accept your proposal. Monetary gift. Oh, you want to play nice? Excellent. Send a gift back of medium. Woo! -hoo. That makes things a lot easier. Oh, the trade is picking up already. Excellent. Now let's go to our constructors. We'll build a few more of those as well. Katrin Utopia, we are pleased to have your empire mining right. Ooh! Which one is Katrin? Very nice. Very, very nice. Um, We're going to give you military refueling rights. Tomb of Kalashibui. Actually, Swamp of Kalashibui and Kalashibui system. We detect runes in the grassy riverside clearing upstream. Investigate. Data core recovered from runes reveals some intriguing information. The data core, navigational directions responding to course. Ten, we should send a ship to investigate. Hmm. 
I really don't know enough about the game yet to actually <laughs> send chips to these things. What will actually happen? Cal Shibui, Agonia Network. Let's speak with them. Oh, they don't know anybody. Secluded Fortress of Gozeria. We've discovered the Secluded Fortress of Gozeria. Escape. Okay. And our spaceport is now up and running. How'd I put fighter bays in that? Pretty sure I put fighter rays on that. Uh, da, 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 large spaceport. We have great design. Did I forget to put fighter rays in there? Oh frack, I forgot to put the goddamn fighter rays in. Okay, we're going to have to do that next. Uh, da, 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 da. Where is fighter base? Okay, so that's five fighter bays in there. Going to manually retrofit that one now. I was wondering there with that. Ooh, they suffered a tsunami. Oh, what the hell are these guys' problem? Okay, they're all my touchy. Okay, time to get our military up and running. Actually, let's go to our designs actually first. Da -da. Manually upgrade design. Fuel capacity is what I'm concerned about now. Uh -huh. What don't we need here? Nope, we need the have modules. Oh yes, we can strip out the standard armor, put in the enhanced armor, and that should free up a little bit more space for us as well. Enhanced armor. And we've got 11 more space. Excellent. What can we put on here? Fuel cell. Here we go. Ah, fuck it. Enough space. Could lose one armor, I guess. If I can find the actual armor here. There we go. 400. That's pretty heavily armed ship right now. Excellent. So, next thing we're going to do, go to our spaceport and we are going to build up our military strength somewhat. Okay, four, five. We have 21 vessels manned and ready. 25, why not? Okay. Thanks. Let's 
Check our research. Nearly there on Continental and damage control. Excellent. Actually, we need to retrofit our ships as well. Get that armor up. I might wait till I have damage control though as well. Probably should have waited there as well. As a result of their experiences, your ambassador Larian Walken has developed a new character trait, Diplomat. Well, I would hope so, him being an ambassador and everything. Encounter new empire. E. Ooh, these guys know a lot of people. New empires. These guys as well. Okay, we now know a lot of empires. See how they all are with me. A lot of angry and annoyed. So we're going to have to see how this all goes together now. Taraka count. Ooh, we have another humans here. Mm hmm. X humans. So, with the extended mod, there's like the X humans, which are a branch off of the human race. They're sort of genetically enhanced, if memory serves. Da -da -da. And they don't really like us that much. Okay. The Sinister Moon Pirates obtain maps that include our area of the galaxy. This means we can now contact the Sinister Moon Pirates. Oh, wonderful. Goodbye. Is that done? Ooh, I need to watch my money, actually. Really? Who the fuck are you guys? I've never even met you. <laughs> we don't trade with you! Why should we be worried about trade sanctions with you? Fucking Muppets? Okay. Really? What did I do to you guys? Okay, you want trade sanctions? Fine, whatever works. Okay, javelins are being completed at a nice rate here. Ooh, they've got nice engine designs as well here. So that's a whole new fleet of ships. Excellent. Let's see what our military strength is now. 1534. Ooh, we are top of dog with the military now. Uh, 
Oh, what the hell? I don't want to go into editor. What the hell? God damn it. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, Empire comparison. Military strength. Where the hell are we? 11. Ooh, the Gerzeria Collective is getting quite bloody strong. I start automating my ships here. Actually, why don't we just do this instead? We can't automate all of them at once, can we? Shit. Never mind that. Okay, they're not built yet. I really love the new engine designs on these. So much better than my old ones. These are fucking badass frigates right now. Okay, we now have damage control. Excellent. Oop, energy and construction needs guiding. Um, we're gonna enhance our shields as well. Should we improve that as well? Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that number three. Yeah, we're just going to go straight for those ones as well. Hmm. Depending on what we should do here with the hyperdrive stone. You know, it's an area that I don't really know that much about, like the rest of the game. Da, da, da. Actually, no, we're going to go for... High speed hyperdrives and hyper streaming. Alright. Now we need to go into our design page here. Are we able to build a capital ship already? Nah, probably not. Need to check that out. And da, 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 da. we are actually gonna auto upgrade our um Oh, I have that bloody bug again where I can't seem to upgrade my freighters and shit. OK, 
Okay, so let's go to frigates anyway. Manually upgrade design. I want to put damage control on there. Does mean losing something else though. Hmm. What don't we need on board her? Okay, we're going to lose one Conradian shields because we are researching them as well. And we are going to put damage control. If I can find it. Okay, it doesn't stack. At least we know that now. And we have 9 4, so we could actually put more enhanced armor now on board. There we go. And the armor is nearly 100 stronger. It's a pretty good trade off, I think. Okay, so we're going to save that one. I'm going to go in here. Select all of my frigates here. And retrofit the whole damn lot of them. Da -da. Javelin, 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 and javelin. Retrofit to that design. Okay, there we go. And that's done. Damn, they're quick turning ships. Hey, thank you. Oh, my ships are so fast now. This is good. Okay, I do need to name those ships as well. How is my colonization thing coming along? I think we did Continental is at ninety is that ninety seven? It is. It's hard to tell with the resolution so god I'm high on this game. Let's go to Ah, there we go. Yeah, that's nearly done. Okay. Oh, that is beautiful to look at. It's like a little firework going off. Our engineers have completed research in continental colonization. The breakthrough allows them to colonize continents. So, the colony ship. Oh, let's go to expansion planner first. Potential colonies. Do, do, do. Distance. Okay, so. We're going to pause the game here a second. We're going to take a look for a colony we need. Da, da, da. Yeah, we're going to colonize here. Are we missing something here, actually? Yeah, then maybe we need to auto-upgrade selected design. So, then again, we're going to retrofit that one straight away. So, Galaxy, another empire has made a momentous discovery of ancient ruins. Put you into the heroic resistance effort. Oh, that's the Shaktori business again. Okay, so.
god, the colony ship is remarkably slow, actually. One second. We need to go into designer here. Manually upgrade design. So what are we missing here? Let's put another couple of accelerators on here. Too many engines and it goes slower. Okay, hmm. save. the next thing in confederacy. Jesus, these guys want to declare war on everyone? They're gonna have to be dealt with. my home system. Jesus. Okay, we do need to slow down the game at this point to normal speed because it is getting a little crazy here. <laughs> Colony ship. Okay, that's retrofitting, so that should take a few moments. ship for that. What was that? Jesus, I really need to figure out the control mechanisms for this game. <laughs> uh, da, da, da. Okay. Okay, we need to start colonizing anyway. Well, let's get down here. So, is that the colony ship? I think it is. No. Okay, so that's traveling nicely there now. Jesus, we're getting a lot of messages in now. that engine up and running. Jesus Christ, this is a slow-ass ship. Let's see if we can colonize here. Okay. Oh, we did want to build some more... Oh, very nice. Uh, okay, so we did want to build some construction ships. Let's plan it more so. Okay, so we're going to get the construction ships up, and... 
these up as well. Okay. This fucking planet here. And why doesn't it want to colonize? It's continental, isn't it? Oh, it's a swamp planet! Fuck! That's why. God damn it. That would make more sense, wouldn't it? Yeah, let's go here. Is there any continental... I'm a goddamn idiot. few colonizable planets here, actually. Yep, we accept your proposal. Ooh, they have a lot of troops there as well. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have to invade that at some point. Um, what are we researching at the moment? Okay, we'll be able to colonize that one pretty soon anyway. Right. Jesus, these guys are expanding at a rapid rate. Varacta. Da, da, da. I can find the Varacta. Twelve column. <sighs> Fucking hell. Yeah, we need to expand. God damn it. I really haven't played this game smartly from the start. Fighters. Well, to select all of these. What's that? Small directional alliance. Okay. Just need to wait a marshy colonization, then we're gonna get that sorted out. We're getting a little boxed in here as well. Did 
Da, da, da. Come up here, nothing there. Okay. It's time we upgrade our mining stations as well. Let's manually upgrade. No shields, no armor. Yeah, these need a massive upgrade. Actually, maybe we should auto-upgrade them and see what happens. Still didn't give it any armor. Hmm. Okay, well at least it's got those on it now. Should we put fighter bays, I wonder? Hmm. They can't hurt. We also need to increase our... This is on it. Ooh, God damn it. I really hate the way that jumps, Scott. Okay, and... Okay... Sessions will be a little more defendable now. There we go. So that is the mining station. Okay, manually upgrade design. Have they put any armor on there? No, they have not. A lot more shielding on that one, though. There, damage control, and some weaponry. Okay, that's a lot better defended now. Okay. Research stations, so automatically upgrade, automatically upgrade, and auto upgrade. See what their defensive capabilities are at the moment. Not a whole lot, but we'll upgrade those as well. Some additional shielding as well. That should help matters a lot. We need to unlock energy collectors as well. Alright. Okay. Need to add to these two as well. Fighter bays in there as well. Fuck it. Nexus blasters. Uh, let's see what else we can put on there. The phase lancers. There we go. Not too much of an increase in maintenance, and that is good. Okay, manually upgrade.
Oh god damn saving. Okay, that's significantly improved. problem. Damn, their population's dropped. Oh, fuck off with your trade sanctions. I'm gonna retrofit you. Oh, I forgot entirely about my explorers. God damn it. Uh, construction ship, okay. Okay, that's that constructor done. Oh, what's going on here? Engage, engage. It's not even cracking the shield. Oh, my frigates are strong. Nice one. What were you doing? I gave you a direct order. Really? They didn't even crack your shields. Well, at least we know they can defend now. That's something, I guess. Actually, I'm gonna send first fleet down here. Um, oh, that's not good. Okay, time to get my fleet out. Do, 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 do. No. I want to select first fleet. Okay, first fleet is here. Okay, we're going to do a little patrol down here. Take out this pirate threat once and for all. Do, 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 do. Come on. Where are my ships? Okay, first fleet is on its way. Let's deal with this pirate problem for the last time. Where is this pirate base that's causing me all this trouble down here?
Nothing here. Do keep powered faction dark trade junction alliance. How do we feel about these two? Uh, the, the trying to find the right bloody name here. So we're on good terms with the Asimov. Okay. Okay. Hey, these guys are getting happy with us. Wonderful. They ain't too happy with my ships being in that area. Oop, Marshy colonization is done. What are we trying to find here? Colonization. Let's go to desert and yeah, that should do it. Why can't I do that one? Oh, we need enhanced transport. Okay. Can we blockade this planet? Do, do, do. Okay, so they're going to blockade on this planet here, which would be good. And now, where is my colony ship? Okay, that was interesting. Anyway, back to my colony ship here. Free trade agreement, yes, that's good. Monitor gift, yes, that's good. Okay, stop disturbing me. And I think it's in this sector, isn't it? Uh, no. I'm trying to find the planet here that I want to colonize. Ah, here we go. Okay, calling this ship. Finally, calmly take. Oh God, damn it. How do you stop your ships from actually entering other people's territory, I wonder? Hmm.
Okay, so we're getting our first colony up and running at least. So that's something. Now, we're going to pause the game here a second. Diplomacy. Now, who are those bastards who... Attacked us here. It was these guys. Damn, they control a lot of colonies. Whew, 244 military ships. These guys are big. Very, very big. MN460 and Astrophil. Okay. Shame we can't click on these. Hmm. Okay, and we do need to rename our other ships as well. I think I'm going to call a halt to the video here, as I'm getting a bit swamped in information that I need to go through. So, we're going to call it a halt here. Hope you enjoyed watching, guys. And the next video, probably going to extend my military significantly. That pirate faction is looking mighty impressive, I must say. So, thanks for watching, folks, and catch you on the next one.